Hi Scorpio, welcome. My name is Trina and this is TNT. Thank you for joining me today. We are going to get into a animal spirit reading for you. So let's get at it. I'm going to draw two animal spirit cards and then clarify them and get some closing cards. Okay, what, um, what do we have for Scorpio as far as animal spirits go? What's the first animal spirit for Scorpio? Grasshopper spirit, take a leap of faith. That's interesting. I just did Cancer's reading and they got the same thing. And I definitely shuffled the cards again and again between readings. Okay, anyway, let's shuffle these up and see what else we get for Scorpio. Okay, um, what else do we have for Scorpio as far as animal spirits goes? So this is not going to be applicable to everyone, so take what resonates, leave the rest. Okay, we have spider. Protection, aid, and wisdom. Spider. Okay, let's clarify these. Okay, so... Why do we have Grasshopper Spirit here for Scorpio? Take a leap of faith. Hmm. Queen of Shells. The Four of Shells. And the Ten of Stars. Okay, so there's a completion. There's something to be completed going on here. It's a completion of a cycle. Um, not a happy one, perhaps. Um, you've definitely been left disappointed. Um, but you are the Queen of Shells here, um, signifying that you have great emotional control and stability and that you are willing to still willing to offer something or someone or yourself unconditional love regardless of the disappointment and the hardships here and the burdens and how hard it's been to live out this cycle the take a leap of faith card is probably here signifying that even though you're you're disappointed go into your new cycle with hope and you know trust that the universe knows what it's doing and what it ha what it hands you um, and take it as it as it comes. Okay, why do we have spider here for Scorpio? The rainbow, five of flowers, and the eight of stars. Okay, so with spider here, which is protection, aid, and wisdom, there's you're holding yourself back um, and having hardships because of it. Um, you are, you do need to be healing here, um, but you're holding yourself back. You need to be healing from whatever this cycle was, um, you need to take the help of others, perhaps. Um, accept the help of others. That's what I get out of that. that. That's what that feels like to me, is accept the help of others. Um, stop fighting that. Okay, uh, let's get three more closing cards for Scorpio. What else does Scorpio need to know here? What else does Scorpio need to know here? So we have the King of Stars, the Six of Shells, and the five of shells okay so there's something that happened in the past that you wish you had done or wish you hadn't done i'm not sure which one it is um but this is signifying that you are now to use your logic and reasoning skills to work this out and let go of whatever needs to be let go of here so that you can stop holding yourself back and move on to the next new cycle that's going to be better for you okay there you have it that is your reading for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Venus, and Rising. Please take what resonated, leave the rest. If you like this reading, please feel free to like, share, donate, comment, subscribe. All of those things do help my channel grow. I hope appreciate all your support, and I hope you have a wonderful day.